Don't know if you know this, but tires are tough to recycle. Here in Tennessee, some specialty companies are trying to get it down to a science. And now a large grant will help Tennessee Tire Recycling in Lebanon pump up their business. News Channel 5's Hannah McDonald explains why it all matters. They're not made to, to just dissolve, you know, and, and when you put a tire in a landfill, it stays in a landfill for hundreds of years. Making these tires history is the goal here. Most of what we're doing is hauling uh, and that initial grind. Lincoln Young oversees all the work at Rockwood Sustainable Solutions in Lebanon. The hard to handle waste streams that the state deals with. The tire side of the business, Tennessee Tire Recycling, takes in tires recycled in local counties and in one day's time processes them to get them ready for their second life. We live in a big state. So we need to be able to move these tires effectively and efficiently. The State Department of Environment and Conservation just gave a $750,000 grant to the company. The grant will be put toward a new truck, trailers for collection, and a mobile grinder. What we're trying to do is work out that network of hauling so that we can get these tires to where they need to be, so that we can get them recycled, and hopefully, at the end of the day, get them back into uh, markets across the state. This is the end product they hope to make more of initially. It can be put in septic tanks. Uh, it actually works as a, a media to help uh, filter the water that's in those septic tanks. And in addition to home construction, recycled tires can be used for landscaping and paving. In the end, breaking down tires is good for the environment. As if they collect rain and rainwater, you get a whole lot of nasty stuff. In order to not create a public health issue, um, that's where tire recycling's really come in as a benefit across our state. In Lebanon, Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5. And the grant money, by the way, comes out of the Tire Environmental Fund. Every time Tennesseans buy a new car, there's a small fee added, which goes into that fund.